<clears throat> Welcome to the Freeland Museum of Denmark. This is a place where they have old houses moved to this place and restored so each and everyone could have a look. It's allowed to go inside the houses and look. We will do that. <coughs> um, actually, this house is one of my friend's old family houses. This was uh, this was moved from about 200 to yeah 200 kilometers. It it probably is tell in that biography over here. Uh, <coughs> moved from here to approximately here. Uh, first half of the 18th century. Hmm. So uh, some years ago he took me in here and showed me the place and his family has changed name two times after since this place was in his family's position. Oh, it's dark. I got sunglasses on because I got workers eyes from yesterday. <coughs> so as you can see, um, 182 cents centimeters high a little bit more than six feet hope you can see in the dark I don't know rifle uh, shotgun front loader muzzle loader This is how the houses were built. Spice. <coughs> We're gonna walk out again. Uh, I believe this was the house, as I recall he showed me this house and told me that this was it. <coughs> so as you can see, you can walk into the houses and take a look, it's an open museum. Uh, first time I've been in here where I had to pay because they, uh, the government took away the fundings from museums, so now you're obligated to pay to walk in these places, which is a shame. It's really nice. <clears throat> Also from the same island of Green. I'm just gonna take my glasses off. I've been in here while this blacksmith was working. Some years ago this blacksmith was operative. They sometimes are. We bought a knife built in here. So as you can see, that's the island of Fyn, this is Shilland, or Zealand. Uh, <laughs> I will come back here this summer and film more because <laughs> 
they are closing the houses off in about an hour this is a huge place and uh, some of the oldest buildings I believe is in that direction over there and one of the mills in here is also another friend of mine family uh, well it's been it's been in through a lot of different families but I don't remember where it is now we'll probably find it maybe this time maybe in another video <laughs> this house was actually moved here in this state and they took quite a long time to uh, configure the building back in this state that it's in <coughs> and it is not falling apart it is very old and was in a mossy place I don't I don't remember if it if it says so in the description <sighs> oldest past from 1600s Yeah. As I was saying, it was on a bog, uh, near a bog, as it's stated in the description. That's why the house is, uh, looks like it's falling apart because the uh, the ground was not solid enough so they just rebuilt and rebuilt until it was usable <coughs> of uh, fire and remember this is uh, <laughs> do not touch the muse in pieces <laughs> remember this is open well the place isn't open all year around but uh, the things are here all year around and they have people that live out here not in these houses but around these places hmm must be cold to live without insulation like that. <laughs> so, in my opinion, these houses are in pretty good shape when thinking about how old they are. We've got a family, uh, I might take some pictures of that, we have a family um, furniture that was made in 1884, I believe, which we use daily in our apartment, which is in a, a very good condition, <coughs> and it was family made. <laughs> so I guess this was this is to show how it was built up and or constructed and I guess this was for maybe for pigs I don't know sheep perhaps 
<coughs> yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah. That place is where the the water mill was that I was talking about. I remember because it was right across this house. Oh yeah. <coughs> this is also a very old house. I don't. Uh, I think it was a shoemaker. If I'm not mistaken. Oh, it is locked. Maybe they have a description. No. We was cottage, so it's not a shoemaker. They moved it to here. That's funny. <coughs> So this little mill is Whoa. gotta take my glasses off. This little mill was another friend of mine's family position. And it has some kind of meaningful, meaningful um, not only use, but it it had some meaning. Um, I can't quite remember what it was, but maybe it was the place. Maybe a king was murdered there, or I don't remember. <coughs> and I can't seem to find the the plaque with the history on. Because it was moved. <coughs> 